Hey guys, just bought this 240 watt solar blanket from Made by Kings. I'm just going to do some testing on uh, to see how much power it generates on a uh, Echo Flow Delta 2 and a lithium battery which I got from eBay. It's about 100 amp. Uh, put it in this box which I got from Anaconda. So let's see how much power it generates. The panel looks all right. Uh, it just uh, it's different to the other panels I had. There's a small dent there. I don't know what is that. Yeah, I think it should be all right. Uh, so I'm gonna test this lithium battery first. I've already connected it to a charger, solar controller charger, which I got from eBay. I think for twenty dollars something. So basically it's generating 13.9 volts and let's see how much volt watts it's producing. So basically if you can see I think it's really hard to see. It's producing about 156 watt. Uh, 155 56 before it was doing 170 but well, the Sun is right above me so it's a good time to test it so this lithium battery with a cheap solar charge controller uh, is giving me 155 56 volts watt and 11.45 amp I had about 13 amp before it's an hour before now it has dropped to 11.5 so it's pretty good I mean I'm happy with this so, I have another one KT solar 120 watt is generating about 60 watt so now let's test uh, this one Delta I uh, don't have a XT60 connection, a proper one, so I got these from uh, Timu for three dollar, four dollar. They have a male connection and a female. I just connected it to Anderson plug. So because this one needs a uh, Anderson female uh, XT60 plug, and um, the voltage says eleven. Watt minimum, maximum 60 and 15 and max. So I'm just gonna plug this into the solar panel. So I've attached this to the solar panel. I'm just gonna push it into the battery. All right, that's in there. And let's see how much power is generating. No, no, it's turned on automatically. Uh, it's producing about 206 watts. That's pretty good. I mean, just uh, 10 minutes before it was giving me 220, and now it's giving me 206. Well, I would say for 200 and a solar panel that cost $230, $20, that's a pretty good output. I mean, the efficiency wise, I think it's probably more way above 90%. So I was less, I wasn't sure where to get it or not, but I'm happy that I got it. So there you go. Two different outcomes for two different batteries. One with a solar charge controller, and one I think there is an inbuilt MPPT solar charge controller inside this Echo Flow Delta 2. So it doesn't need a solar. You don't need a solar charge controller. Just the battery with an extension cord. There you go.